So, I just got done flying an awesome RB match. So, as you can see, it was midway. Um, and it was RB, just like I just said. And I got three kills. So this guy, he almost outscored me by sheer assists alone and one kill. But this feels good. This feels good. And one of the guys, Mr. Wolfman there, was actually, okay, this guy was high level and I didn't kill him, I believe. Uh, but these two I think were together. Look at their names. I killed this this guy. And those two guys. And these, these other two guys are uh, uh, low ranking. For the most part, their whole team is low ranking with the exception of those two guys. This guy here, again, he's level 52. He's a bit be, uh, under underneath me by 20 plus uh, levels. Uh, this guy, um, he tried to hit on me, and uh, I almost fell for it. He got one of the other guys, and I was like, I'm not putting up with this. So I ended it. Uh, so what we got here was bulletproof. Um, we got Terror of the Sky. Uh, we got the final blow as well. And then we got these. Um, so we got one assist. Activity 92% reward. We got reward bonus for winning. Now I am flying with pre uh, with premium, um, and this was not a premium plane, but uh, the rewards are are pretty good because I'm flying it in uh, in RB. So uh, this is not bad for this level of plane, and this is what I need to keep doing. I need to keep flying this plane because once I get the fundamentals ingrained in flying the low level planes, I can benefit, you know, it would only benefit me when I start flying the uh, the higher uh, level planes. Um, so, and plus this is a, a great plane to get used to flying uh, RB with. And this time I didn't rip my flaps. <laughs> so, uh, we'll, we're going to look at the, the replay in a few minutes. I just want to kind of look at this here. So we couldn't at first we couldn't find the last guy and I asked if anyone had a blind hunt and I was looking for dots. I said I see no dots and then as soon as I said that I saw him and he was battling a guy and uh and the uh another guy that was in the area he was going to land on the carrier because I don't know if he was out of ammo or he was damaged uh, it was my squad mate actually and uh, so he was you know this other guy that was battling Wolfman was left alone and uh, so he got the kill another guy came in so he got the kill and then that freed him up for me I was trying to get there so we could tag team him uh, because I knew that he was a higher level guy and uh, it didn't work out. I didn't get there in time. So, but anyways, let's uh, let's uh, play this uh, replay here. Oops. So, why is this footage special? This is the first three kill game uh, that I had that I've had in RB. Um. So yeah. Uh, it's cool. Um, what plane did I use? Uh, the key 44 dash two. Well, why that plane? Because if you look at my stats, let's put this here. If you look at my stats, you'll see that all of my kills uh, most of my kills for Japan and in fact for RB for all of my planes I fly out the key 44-2 the most 
I've gotten the most kills. I've gotten probably the least deaths compared to kills. I've flown this out the most. There's 15 battles. And so I'm comfortable with the plane. Um, a lot of people will say that this particular plane um, is not a good plane to fly. Um, so in RB, you get a 2.7 BR. So that's not bad. Um, it climbs like a bat out of hell. Um, and we'll see that shortly. Right now, I'm, I'm flying level. Well, I was because I went to desktop. I had to do something on the desktop. So now I'm back, and I've got a hit, I've got a hit of speed from being idle for a bit. So I'm gonna burn that off. So you're gonna see me burn it off, and then you're gonna see the plane kind of settle down at probably like 270 kmh range. And by that time, I'm pitched up 20 degrees, and I'm out of web. I decided to get out of web. And I am not losing any speed at all when I do that. So here it is. I'm actually gaining speed. Pitch 20 degrees up. So uh, here you go. I adjust it. So 281. I'm not in. I'm not in web, and I'm climbing like a beast. So it's slightly increasing and it's probably going to increase as I climb up. As I get up in altitude, it's going to start gaining speed. It's going to become it's going to be become more efficient to make power up, up in the higher altitude with this uh, particular plane. So uh yeah, I'm, I'm climbing like crazy. Um it's it's maneuverable, but not as maneuverable as the Key 43s. Um this is more of a boom and zoomer compared to them because it carries a ton of speed. It's it's a lot faster than the, the key 43s. Um, at least for for this BR, uh, this BR range. So when you get into the key 43-3 uh, Atsu, which is the the cannon busa, uh, that that's a total different. That's a totally different uh, story. It's a totally different plane. But anyways, uh, so we're climbing here. And while I'm climbing, usually what I'll do is I'll check the stats of the enemy team. So I'll do this. And I'll do it for every one of them. Because I want to know... Let me go back here. I want to know uh, who, I'm, who I'll be flying against. I don't want to just pick anyone and the next thing you know, I've, I've got more than I bargained for. Right? So... But but again, I've shot down even in R in, in RB. I've shot down level 100 guys. Um, it and it happens more often than you think. Um, you know, the level 100 guys have bad days just like I have bad days. Um, it doesn't always work out for them. Sometimes they get blindsided just as I get blindsided. And when you come down to it, rank doesn't always indicate that you. At, are at the top of your your skill set so some of these guys might have been playing War Thunder for a very long time and because of that they've gradually went up in the ranks and gained level 100 that doesn't necessarily mean that they're good right so what I did was I checked these two guys out there were two guys in particular that I, I, I wanted to watch for so it is um, this guy and this guy. So this guy's a level 90 something. This guy's a level 50 something. And the rest of them are like level 15, level 25, or whatnot. So I wanted to focus on the two higher end guys. And I figured once those guys are taken care of, we could just cl clean house. Um, well, wouldn't you know, those, you know, toward the end of the game, those two were the only two left um, but we we eventually won anyways and I ended up getting one of them I didn't get both like I had planned um, my my squad mate which is shorty shorts he got the uh, 
He got the level 50 guy. He got the bomber. That's his name, the bomber. And I got Wolfman. And there's a wolf girl in here, so I'm assuming that's his girlfriend or his wife, or maybe that's a wolf clan. I don't know. So uh, I have a feeling that they came in together. So someone's already chasing the bomber. And I didn't check to see what type of kills the bomber got when we, when we got done. So I'm up here. I'm trying to wait for things to play out. I finally got a tally on everyone. A lot of times I won't dive all the way down until I try to account for everyone in the match. And uh, at the very least you account for the higher ranking guys and they're down there wolfman went somewhere i don't know if he got damaged i pinged him actually nicked him and then i pulled up when i saw this guy and i'm like shit what's he gonna do i got a i got a decent amount of energy and so i'm probably i'm thinking about split essing down there and here we go and he's already got my teammate. If I tried harder, I could have turned into him. But then I heard engine sounds behind me and I kind of freaked out and pulled away. And it turned out to be my teammate. But there's a guy to the left of me. And we're going to go for him. That's the same guy from last time, and he will be my first kill. And here we go. Plane is pretty damn maneuverable. I know, I've, I've flown him before. Never an RV, though. And it's almost like he blacked out, because he kind of froze up for a second. So he's burning, and I got the kill. So, at this point, they've only got one, two, three people left. Wolfman, engine damage, out of bombs. So, he went somewhere. I think he landed on a carrier with that A36 and got repaired. So, at this point, there's only, I mean, one, two, three guys down there on the enemy team. So Wolfman finally finished repairing and he's on the way. And so what I'm doing is I'm trying to line up for the bomber, but I've got a little bit too much speed and I'm I shouldn't have come down straight on top of him. I should have waited a bit. And I end up bypassing both of them. That guy's leaking, uh, looks like fuel. There goes the P-38 that I noticed, and I'm turning left to avoid him, but I have over 500 uh, KPH in speed, and I don't want to blow it, so I'm kind of leveling off, trying to figure out what to do, where what he's doing, and so I'm going to high yo-yo once I figure out that he's going down there. He's going for a boom and zoom just like he did last time. So Wolfman hasn't showed up yet. He isn't dead yet. So right now it's Mr. Electric and the bomber. And so he does his boom and zoom. He misses and he's extending away from the key 61. And he's doing really well, but the thing is, I've got a lot of speed. I've built up, and I'm pulling on him, and now he's climbing as well. And we talked about the climbing of this plane earlier, and so now he's topped out. Yeah, I got the kill. What I was trying to do is I was looking for sparks. I was looking for indicator that, you know, indication that I was leading correctly. And I never saw that, so I was like, oh, you know what? I don't want to let him pass. So I went ahead and just unloaded on him. 
and it just it happened to work um, so now I'm cooling down the engine because the engines overheated I think it was the oil so my squad mate shorty has just killed the bomber and now he's hightailing it to get repaired at the uh, <clears throat> at the aircraft carrier. And I'll notice we've got we've captured B. The thing is, I don't know how safe it is. I don't know if he could get strafed while he's there, and he probably felt safer by going to uh, to land on the carrier. Um, I can't land on the carrier. Every time I try with this plane, I, I die. So maybe I need to practice that. Um, it it has no hook either, so um, that makes it all the harder. So now Wolfman and and Griffon are going at it, and Griffon is probably so he's chasing him now. But the Key 61 he needs altitude, and he's too low. The A36 is pretty powerful, and so now Griffon is giving chase to Wolfman. And I'm gonna split S down under him, you know, to, to get behind him and watch what he does. He, and he almost gets me. And I'm not even aware that he's doing it. He's come back up at me. He touches me, but I also touch him. Uh, we don't crit each other, there's no damage or nothing. And so he actually kills uh, Griffin, but he's blown his energy in doing that and I have a ton of it right now I'm touching 600 kph and so he decides to try and go to the ship for cover and I'm like no that's not happening I pull under him I, I get <coughs> what do you call it uh I pull under him and cut into him and get the kill It felt so good for this to finally come together. And I know this is nothing to 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 RB veterans, but this is this is actually something to me. That means that all of my time spent in RB lately is paying off. And that I'm becoming confident in flying this particular plane. I've gotten several kills in TAS, you know, 154s, and uh, I think I got two kills in the with the XP-55, but this one is, I'm really comfortable in flying, even though, you know, a lot of people talk shit about the guns. The guns are not bad. They're 450 cals, and you saw me, I, I killed two planes outright and got one smoking, and it burned to the ground, or... It, it burned totally burned out I wouldn't say to the ground because it's in the air right <laughs> so um, yeah uh, that was fun um, the bomber got two kills wolfman got one wolf girl got one and mr. electric got one the rest of their team n nothing um, we did a lot better so we had two people that got more than one kill not including me um, so shorty shorts and G blaster and then several guys like Griffon and Baxter they got ex they you know they got kills themselves um, so a bunch of assists here Griffon got three assists and I had a game earlier today where I was a uh, what was I flying um, it was not today it was yesterday um, I was either flying the P I think it was a P47 uh, the German version and uh, I got three assists and I, I got I ended up getting an insane amount of RP for the fact that I didn't get any kills and I'm like what the hell and this guy did too because I was looking at the score as we were playing and I'm like I've got two kills. He's gotten one, but he's gotten three, and he out he was out 
he had outscored me uh, before I got that last uh, that last kill, and, and it was because of the uh, the the assists. And I was like, wow, so that's cool. Um, but yeah, um, this was a great match.